How heartbreaking. This man was murdered in Mogadishu for less than a penny. The similar thing happened in Muktisho and surrounding areas two months ago when someone was slain for 0.5 penny. The country's security has gotten out of hand under Hassan Sheikh's leadership. <laughs> ها <laughs> مسكيني كرتا مجر عدا كلات وعين غني إذا عدا للذرو تاجر مدير الصومالية حضر الشيخ محمود إذا وزال حمزة وعنك عسرينا دكا مساكين تأه وعنا ودى الجعل وضمي مانت مجلس مي شنك من الصومال ذكس أي عنا نكا مانت لغو بلي مالك وحان عسرينا عدا لدي دلبنا يان دكا مساكين أبريم للي يقانو نكا استوحبين وكو كروي يقانا لما مساكين عندك دار سنوها مالك عدا لدى ملحوين حسن شيخو وحوان بو هدا الشي جيسي عدا لدى هدي مانتا اقرب برتو والله بالله اتلا دل محقاقا دول المدسيس Are we cursed to have leaders like Hassan Sheikh, Dini, Warlord Bihi, and Warlord Ahmed Madobi who are leading Somalia to disaster? A few months ago we were optimistic about Somalia's future with Mr. President Farmejo at the helm until Hassan Sheikh arrived to demolish everything in a few months. <laughs> إذا ولا يوم كوري ده نيسا، بس كده رصنا نيسا. إماراتكو، مكو أقول يا حسن شيخو، ليس كأسكر توضح حتى أنا آخر دي، ما قعدوا بس، أنا آخر دي مكو أقول لي، معو أسكر توضح أمة مريعة، أدي أنا أسكر توضح حتى ما قعدوا ذا أنا مكو أقول لي نعرف، بس كده أنا ما بمشي، لا تدود من نور دي بكران، لو ما أنا ما دينا هنا، أنت أسكر أي لي من نور شيء كران، بلا هيك الدقيقين كلي من نور شيء كران، س. Mutual interest, mutual respect. What are they doing? Or do they not know that the world is a diplomatic relationship? Who? I don't understand. What is the end? What is the end? If you don't understand, you don't understand. What is the end? No one is coming to save Somalia. Somalis must wake up and save their motherland. Rwanda can be our role model. If you read history, you'll know if peace and prosperity was possible in Rwanda, it is possible in Somalia too. If we kick out this horrible and corrupted president, said one of the SYL party. Rule number eight. Nobody is coming to save you. Get up. Be your own hero. Rule number eight. Nobody is coming to save you. Get up. Be your own hero. I have never seen this kind lineup of charcoal. Yet we know addressing this where it needs. People who cut trees are ex-farmers or herders. They both in economic stress and disadvantage caused bad leadership and corruption with currently government. They longer able to farm or livestock. Profits and greed over environment protection. This is the black gold that generates revenue for the federal government, federal states, and Al-Shabaab. They are united in deforestation and causing environmental degradation. A total ban by the government can make a huge change which had happened with previous government but unfortunately this president has sold out the very thing and anything that we have.